The official B Plays Dolly plushie is now available. Head over to bplays.com forward slash plush to get your own dolly today. Link in the description. Hello wonderful little beans, my name is B and welcome back to my channel. Before we get started with today's video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell and of course use that code B when buying Robux or Premium. I think it's about time I updated these little emotes that I do at the beginning. I feel like there's some more exciting ones out there now so I probably need to update that for the next video. So keep your eyes peeled, you might notice that next time. Now you guys, there's been a question I have been asked quite a lot recently, especially during my live streams about badges in particular because there are four badges inside of royal high that everybody has wanted to get ever since they were first leaked ages and ages and ages ago but it appears that people don't understand how to get them right now the fresh berry badge has been won by about 11,000 people but out of the probably nearly 200,000 people now that have played campus 3 that's not very many people who have obtained it so many people have been asking me b how do we actually get the fresh berry badge in the game so as you guys know right now inside of the journals most people will have this one here the fresh fairy some people are starting to obtain the other ones but it's very rare and unlikely that they will get them because they are actually quite difficult to obtain they are in my journal just from developer stuff from before but technically speaking i am actually a fresh fairy you can check by going into your planner and going all the way to the end and it says right here your grade status fresh fairy now for lots of you guys who are trying to get the fresh fairy badge it will say new student instead which means you've just joined campus three so how do you actually obtain these badges inside of royal high well let me explain to you guys what you need to do if you go over to the Royal High game page, you'll see these four badges right here. Turned into a Fresh Fairy, turned into Sophomore Mermaid, turned into a Junicorn, and turned into Senior Royalty. So as you guys can see, they each have a description. So let's have a look first at these three, because these two actually say how you win them. As you can see, Sophomore Mermaid is earned by playing 100 plus hours in Royal High. Now just to be clear, Callin said that this is only counted in Campus 3 playtime. So other words you guys this is based on how long you have played campus 3 for so while you may have played more than 100 hours in total of royal high in the past it only counts since campus 3 released then junicorn is 600 hours play time and senior royalty is 1000 hours play time so people are wondering how do we get this fresh fairy badge since it's the welcome to the high school fresh fairy or magical journey of royal high awaits it's very clear that there's no actual hours requirement written here like the other ones so how do we get that badge well right now you guys people actually don't really know and the reality is most of my friends and most people in my audience have been obtaining the badge just randomly and haven't really been able to figure out how they got it so what i think happens you guys is i think you just have to play inside of campus 3 and eventually you will get it for actually doing so so basically i think you just need to actually be in here completing quests participating in things and just doing stuff inside the game and eventually you will actually just happen to get it so as you can see there's various quests that you can complete inside of here i think that if you complete the quest like my friends have been doing and also my viewers eventually you will just happen to get the badge so i'm guessing you guys since it's a fresh fairy one rather than just giving it to everybody the second they first join instead they are giving it to people over time for actually being here and participating in stuff so my guess you guys is that you need to actually come and actually participate in things in side of raw high and as you do you will actually unlock it so obviously just completing quests and being a part of things can then upgrade you from that new student status to the fresh fairy status now some people have wondered if maybe the badge has been broken for them and they were supposed to get it but there is an easy way to check that to make sure that you are actually supposed to have the badge the way to do this is to just head on into your diary you guys and go to the end of your main page the journal section or the planner section actually you guys go right to the end and you'll see your status here and it says grade status fresh 
fairy. If it says fresh fairy, you are supposed to have the badge. If it says new student, you are not yet supposed to have it. And so you'll have to wait until you get to that fresh fairy status, which will take however long it takes based on the fact that you need to just play and hopefully you'll get it eventually. I think the idea is, you guys, that it's a new badge. And obviously the whole point is that players get it who are participating in the game and playing the game regularly rather than just giving it to everybody who logs in. So you still have to actually obtain it. I don't know the official way to obtain it, but I'm guessing you just have to participate in things and actually play the game, you guys. So hopefully you managed to each get your fresh fairy badge soon. Good luck to all of you. And thank you so much for watching. I'm going to be looking in the lost and found for a bit. And if you guys enjoyed this video, found it helpful in any way, please don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell. And of course, use that code B when buying Robux or Premium. I'll see you guys tonight for more live stream coverage of Campus 3.